Uh, stalker child, enjoy. Your oh, I did forget something. You reminded me. You reminded me. I forgot something, and then you reminded me of it. The stalker child, enjoy presents for five. Says the following message is transmitted at the request of Dr. Ron Paul. It's happening. I could have saved you. I tried to warn you, but you looked away. You've made your bed. Now lie in it. It's over. Um, remove the green. Undo this damage. Where is where is the green at? Where's the green at? Did I do? Oh, I see. Okay. Okay. Where is it? Um, here. Okay. I have some clips actually from this. Let's watch this. They're just targeting some useless fucking guy that doesn't really particularly contribute anything to society. He's not on some noble mission. He's not trying to save lives. He's not trying to reform the government. He's not doing he, anything to yeah, try to make this country is. a better place to live. Oh, so you haven't seen my Twitter at all. So the guy, the guy is basically trying to do him a service and be like, you're not like a politician. You're not trying to like make yourself out to be like a hero. You're not really notable. You're just a science fiction author. So it's really terrible that these people are trying to harass you and fuck with you so much. And then he, like, you can see his face, like, contort in pain as this guy vision. enumerates how fucking fat and irrelevant he is. Like, he's actually agonized hearing how, how, how this guy actually thinks about him Th and how he thinks about him in a way that he thinks is a benefit to his cause. And then he has, what, what does he fire out? To make him to correct him that no who stalker child actually i am politically relevant and i do try to save lives and make the world a better place twitter at all you haven't seen my twitter if you saw my twitter you'd know what a contributing member of this political world i really am that's excellent that's pure excellent um that's the whole interview Uh, yeah, the audio is now cutting out a little bit, so I think that filtering's on maybe a little too high. I'm sorry. Damn, he's old, man. Look at this. Look at this old man. <laughs> he, looks, he looks like a perfect blend between Mike Staclaza from Red Letter Media and uh, Norm MacDonald. Do you know what I mean? Is that too mean to say? He looks a lot like Norm MacDonald, but just like halfway between Norm and uh, Mike Staclaza. <laughs> Child, no. <laughs> That's my favorite game to play when I watch a movie. So if somebody looks familiar to me, I try to come up with like who, who they remind me of. The courts have been less than useless. The courts have actively harmed us at every step of it. The, the courts and law enforcement have at every turn encouraged our stalkers, rewarded our stalkers, told our stalkers what they were doing is great and that they're special and they should never, ever, ever stop because they will never, ever face any sorts of consequences. And they should Dude, keep going until we're dead. Do the, that just goes to show you that picking Chris as your reason d'entente or whatever for a forum was a bad idea. Fucking ONA people pick Patrick Tomlinson to be their ground zero locale in the city of Milwaukee. The courts of Milwaukee and the police department of Milwaukee are giving quasi medals. They're sending him paperwork with like wax seals, congratulating him on, on what a great job he's doing. Meanwhile, me, I get fucked with by everybody. If I had picked Patrick Tomlinson, Donald Trump would have nominated me to the FCC by this point. I really fucked up. I should have gone with the the safe bet, the safer bet, and picked Tomlinson as my uh, my my uh, prime my prime subject. It's not too late. We can rebrand. We can rebrand to the Patrick the Patrick Farms, the Tomlinson Farms. You see Patrick Tomlinson, you see people making fun of him, and you're just like, yeah, that makes sense. Uh, there's a whole 40-minute long interview, if you'd like to see more of this, but the, the this clip in particular is great, where he's, look at that smug fucking face. If only you knew the quality of my tweets, stalker child, you would know that I, I am, am a political genius, and I am saving lives. It's amazing. Great. Excellent. Thank you. 
for reminding me. Thank you for pat posting. It's pat posting saves lives. Thank you for watching this clip by Colonel J. This is the King of Bold here. Remember to like and subscribe. Juice.